welcome once again to another try on to another testing out new products video my name is Olin and this is Modest Sisters so on here I try to talk on fashion sustainable fashion accessories and doing reviews for you guys and basically all those good things and so if that's your thing definitely consider sticking around today we're talking about Naked, the brand Naked, I believe they're Swedish. I ordered from their Reborn collection, which is catering to sustainability. I ordered a couple of items which are meant to be of organic origin. So their thing is similar to most fast fashion brands, but they have made a pledge towards sustainability. However, the reason why they tickled my fancy this time, particularly rather than your H&M or your Zara, because those fast fashion brands do have a section that caters to sustainable fashion, but I'm not too keen on it. But uh, Naked, however, I am keen on their quality and edginess. They offer you a level of edginess that is, yeah, sometimes hard to find on high street. Like what I'm wearing right now, it's subtle, but there is, there is character there. There is personality in this, and we'll get onto that in a minute. But so I ordered from their Reborn collection, and I also ordered a couple of organic materials uh, in the form of clothes. Uh, so I believe their pledge is mainly on transparency. So telling you and I where the clothes are made and in what factories or what type of factories they're made in. And obviously those factories are meant to be uh, those that are dear to sustainability and you know sustainable standards, basically. This is actually my first time ordering from Naked themselves. Usually I get items by Naked from ASOS. So by ordering directly from them, I kind of got the shopping experience and without wasting or rambling on, let's just jump straight into the next item, into the first item. So the first item is this blue off shoulder dress and it is their collaboration with Jasmine Azizam. I picked this dress as what I would do for you guys on this try on because of the cutout, this detail. I love it. I, I felt it was so unique and it was very summery. Um, what I have in mind with the pieces I've selected is what I imagine you guys are currently in the market for, maybe weddings, summer parties, summer barbecues, summer events, right? Because we're all excited to be out or well, coming out soon. Ish. I like the color and I like that this is um, obviously from their uh, Reborn collection, which means that this material was supposedly sustainable choice. So what does the size say? So the comp the profile of this dress is 55% organic cotton and then 45% cotton and then 5% elastic. The dress itself, the design is pretty cool. The quality is really good. It's a very thick material. It almost feels like a super soft denim because it's that thick. I think it will be great for summer evenings because of the long sleeved shoulders. It's more of a cool summer summer evening type of dress uh, when it's like 26 degrees upwards this is not what you want to wear because it's it, it will be breathable because it's cotton but the long sleeved i think the long sleeves i think will be a bit irritating the cutout detail however is beautiful i really really like that and i actually ordered this uh size up so it's in a 44 European size 44 that's because I wanted it to be so loose I do not I don't want anything hugging I just wanted it to sit on me and I just go about my day and definitely this one is a keeper for me because it's very very comfortable it's very free uh, very airy and the hole on the side is all just gives it that extra air space <laughs> Okay, going on to item number two. It is actually the dress I am wearing right now for you guys. Now, yes, I'm standing in front of you with a half, half pinned dress because it doesn't fit. But I expected this problem. I knew when I was ordering what I was going to get because it was a size 38. And of course, I have gained weight as I keep saying. I know I'm no longer a size 38. I'm no longer a size 10, all of that stuff. But the dress is so beautiful. I just, I had to have it. And I'm prepared to take it to the tailors to add material on here and 
to widen it for me basically of course it's going to be a different color slightly but i think it's going to be cute still i think this dress is so beautiful hence i was prepared to do all of this with it and it was on sale so it's going to be inexpensive it's going to be worth it basically it's going to work out okay so um i got this and this is actually a hundred percent cotton this time a hundred percent organic cotton so we get a hundred percent organic cotton in this dress and i can say it feels really soft and it feels really really durable uh of course it's denim it's got that denim vibe the tiniest bit of elasticity of course uh it's five percent elastic in this and then 95 percent organic cotton so i know the color is probably going to fade but i don't think it's going to be a bad type of fade uh, i think i'll be okay with it the length is questionable but i think it is mainly because it's super tight right now when i loosen it i'll be able to see what the length is saying basically and i will also be using this as like a top so i'll put a really long dress or, or a skirt over it and just utilize the top detail when i'm styling and playing around with it but overall i love it i love 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 it i love the arm length i like that it's really long actually it comes just you know it comes quite up um than your typical dress would do the material the quality is there and the stretch is a little bit there as well when it's a when it's the right size i think the stretch is just enough to hug the right things you know okay so dress number three is the draped dress the it's beige slash stone it's a really cool color with a slit as well this is funny so that is 30 percent recycled polyester and the rest is just regular polyester so i don't know if that counts as sustainable if part of it is from a sustainable material but the other isn't I don't know how I feel about that but anyway in terms of the quality it's really it's fine it's once it's on it's pretty it looks pretty but the quality it's really um, thin it, you definitely need an insert so if you were buying at a higher price or at a brand that offers a little bit more quality this would have lining or it would be thicker material there'll be a lot more work to it but this is literally just it's really simple but it can work the issue with it is it has a slit so if you wore a slip dress inside or like um, a tummy control or something to smoothen you inside it will show unless you've got one of the skims you know tummy control pieces which are cut on one leg and long on one leg but um, otherwise you're gonna struggle because you you have to wear it as it is basically and the material is one that whatever you're wearing in terms of panty even a thong the line will show because it's quite thin um, so the quality for that one is quite questionable its concept however i like it i like the color i like the drape i like um, it's not easy to take off if i may add but uh, everything else is okay for how much i paid for it would i keep it I don't think I'm going to keep it because I believe I can find similar this a similar concept in a better quality. So I am on the market for drape, you know, a cow neck type of dress, really free flowing like this. Put a belt on it, size bigger. I actually got this in a 44, EU 44, so that I can put a belt on it and I've got different looks out of it. But as it is, I'm not impressed with the quality. So that will not be staying with me. I'm sorry to say. <laughs> The next dress is the cutout knit dress. Now I got this because I was so curious to know how thick the knit is and how the length will look on me because the model seems tall and I'm five foot three and curvy and really thick, I would say. I wanted to see how it would sit. So as you can see, um you can see my bra uh, and when I wear it, the cutout. I'm big chested, so my bras are gonna be, my boobs are gonna take up a lot more material. So the curve is gonna go really out, therefore taking up more material, which means where typically it would, like the cut would just be showing a little bit lower. For me, it's a little bit higher, therefore showing my bra because 
my chest area is using up a lot of that material so that's something you need to keep in mind now i don't think it's a deal breaker i'm contemplating keeping it because this dress gives me kim k vibes the length and let me just check the percentage of cotton it is because that matters on how long it's going to last okay so <laughs> It's 50% organic cotton and then 50% acrylic. So my plans with that dress is to get the, you know, the uh, uh, bralette that is quite long or has got an extra bit of lace. So that will show there, maybe in a color as well. So that is interesting or just in a black. Uh, so a little bit of lace is doing peekaboo over here that's what i have in mind for it i think it's a keeper because i really enjoy the quality i'm hoping that it will shrink down as well i got a large because i wasn't sure i was i was nervous but i should have really got a medium because I, it's it's really stretchy and it's knit and i think it's cool it's fine it's just knowing your body and making it work and of course this is why i do these trials for you guys so you can see what's going on this white top um i got it just to see now as you can see again the same thing um, my boob area takes up a lot of the material it actually looks like a uh, bandeau or bandois um, and it doesn't look like a top you know it's really yes it was a cropped top to begin with that is the idea but um, it's a little bit too cropped and that's actually in a large so had I gone for a medium or anything like that it would be game over it's just a hundred percent cotton so it's not organic cotton it's just a hundred percent cotton now it's really soft it's really cute um i don't know i'm not sure about that one i'm not decided so in terms of my chest by the way i'm a 32 uh g now i've tried this stuff i can kind of have an idea of how they their sizes work and when i'm ordering from there i can kind of gauge you know how do i want this to sit based on experience and ordering like this first order last item is the bow which is which is an accessory a hair clipping or a brush whatever you want it to be i got it because i've been looking for that sort of thing for the longest time and i just i didn't want an alice band i wanted a bow i even considered buying a ribbon and sewing it up but i'm not that crafty and when I did see it, but I saw it in brown, I'm thinking maybe I'll dye it black, just dip it in fabric dye black, or I'll leave it like it is. Brown is cool, it's cute. It's just an accessory and it's really cute and I liked it. So, and I'm impressed with it in person. It's really soft, it's really big. I will say it's bigger in person than I thought it would be, uh, but not in a bad way, in a cool way, especially the pin. The pin's huge in the picture, it's not that big um but it's cool we're cool with that so on their website naked they do offer um a pre-loved section so if you are shopping around and you click on an item you can either yes you can either select to shop only in their pre-loved section or if you happen to find something and they also have it in pre in as a second hand version uh then they will give you that option to buy it as second hand and of course the price will be slightly less it's not clear what free love means whether they took it from you and me or it is because it's excess from samples or from runway i don't know uh it's not clear but you get it it, it says you know give garments more life i don't know anyway it's not clear but if you want to opt for that, definitely do. I'll do more research as well to find out myself. <gasps> I missed out a top. Yes. <laughs> I missed out the black top. The black top, the organza black top, didn't actually fit. That is 60% recycled polyester and then 40% just regular polyester. That is part of their sustainable, their aim towards being more sustainable i guess maybe they're doing it a bit at a time you know introducing recycled materials i don't know what the issue is because last time i checked it we have an abundance amount of waste that needs to be recycled so why are we introducing the recycled materials and drip drop and then mixing it with unrecycled material i'm baffled by that if you know the answer to that comment below but anyway so the black top didn't fit and i know why i got a 38 and it didn't fit it wasn't sipping up because of course my boob area but i think even if it had fit i don't think i would have enjoyed it because it's literally just like me there's nothing luxe about the type of 
organza or mesh anyway the top is not for me it's not a keeper uh even if it fit i don't think i would have enjoyed this the quality and i didn't appreciate the elasticated arms it just looked it looked weird but yeah let me know your thoughts and definitely comment below what's your favorite have you shopped from naked before and if you have any other stores that you want me to check out their sustainable range let me know please don't tell me zara or h&m because i'm not a fan thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video which is going to be next week sunday once again 6 p.m british summer time Mwah.